Hello everybody, my name is Rusash and today I'm going to be telling you guys how to make an easy honey for Minecraft 1.17 plus. Anyway, let's get on with the video. And the first thing you want to do is super simple double chest right here. This is where all your honey is going to go. And the second thing you want to do is you want to place a hopper facing into the chest just like this. With so a little nub right there. See that little nub? Yeah, it's facing into the chest. Then you want to place a temporary block on top of the chest and place another hopper facing into that temporary block. So the two little nubs should be facing one direction and one direction only. So it should look something along the lines of this, like where the two nubs are facing right or left depending on how you were looking at it now enough of that technical stuff let's place two blocks in the freaking beehive i then place a dispenser on the little corner see the little corner of the hopper right there right there so if i were to destroy this beehive the you know the dispenser is facing into the beehive all right now time for the hardest redstone you're ever going to do in your life is what many people think but the, re realistically i'm literally placing two comparators and a re repeater uh, all you need to do place two blocks right here make an entire goddamn excavation site then destroy this block this block and this block so I made an entire excavation site over here and you I have something look like this. There's a block right there, 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 and there, and it should look something like this. Like a like a tilted arrow of some sort if you you, know, you tilt your head or whatever. And get a comparator. Yeah, what the hell do these things do? I place two redstone dust. Re destroy this little middle block over here. Place a repeater on the little corner. See the little corner right click. And it should be facing like towards the chest stuff. Then you want to place some weird redstone torch placement. Destroy this block and place it right there. So it should be something along the lines of this. Yeah, it should be like this. Then we all you need to do is make the super easy circuit of the freaking uh, honey harvester circuit. So just place three blocks right here. Three blocks on top of the dispenser. Or should I say to the right of it. Then a freaking comparator. Geez, so many of these things. Place one, two, three, four, five of redstone dust right here right click uh, on here so the freaking uh, what's it called the, the the connection stops because this is stupid like this is bad i right, once you have this you want to make a really easy item sorter just get in your second hopper right here right click it place 18 blocks in these four slots so let's say a uh, one two three four uh let's say one two three four and uh, one two three four five so 5 plus 5 is 10, 4 plus 4, that's what, like, 4. Then you want to place a freaking uh, honey block, or should I say honey bottle? Is it honey bottle? Yes, you want to place a honey bottle. This is basically, like, telling the machine, I just want honey bottles, everything else is garbage. Alright, so you place your honey bottle in there. All you need to do is place your normal bottles, which you will. These are the ones that will be harvesting the, uh, the, 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 whatever this is. The beehive, yes, the honey from the beehive. And, by the way, if you're scared that your comparator turned on, do not worry that's just this that's just this turning out the comparator do not worry guys let me place a couple of glass bottles in there i'll put 64 but if you're going to be building a lot of these i suggest putting like at least 128 because this is quite a good supply of food i'm not gonna lie i'm gonna quickly fill up this excavation site because it's really getting in the way all right you think we're over no we are not all right you need to get some flowers all right redstoners or survivalist i know annoying decoration right ew but but you need this you actually do it's for the bees to hover around the front area of like the machine so they only stay in this general area and oh uh, the next step that i'm going to do is completely optional by the way so if you're a survivalist and you have don't don't much have much resources did I, did I say that weirdly i'm basically just building a huge enclosure out of glass so the bees don't escape but again this is completely optional because most of the time the bees don't escape again most of the time and this is optional do not place a block here they need to get in the beehive somehow guys i would really recommend destroying these two blocks so they have enough room and fly area yeah, because you do not want anything that is disturbing the farm in any any sort of way i'll get two doors uh destroy these two just place it right there now it's not been creative i'm just gonna spawn in three bees right here so one two three but uh if you were not oh brick but if you were not in creative you'd have to find a plains biome which they usually spawn in plains biomes uh bees just saying if so if you want to do this in survival they usually spawn in that type of area oh oh just like that did you see that oh again again they, they're going in the freaking uh, beehive so they, they're getting pollen jeez stop being so slow come on come on no! Well, this guy's really stupid, but the other two did go in, and they're currently in the process of making hoodie. And just like that, this thing is basically done. It's super simple, super cheap. Oh, oh, look, it just went in. But like I was saying, that that is literally, that is the entire farm. It's super easy, super simple, and basically it's infinite food because, you know, honey actually gives you like food hunger bars so subscribe if you found this entertaining or you learned a thing or two and tell me in the comments if you build this in your single player world because i definitely did 